spotlight. Here, I made two of them, so we could be brothers. Oh, well, as if one wasn't enough. On the surface, Henry Evans seems like the good son. He's bright, loyal to his friends and family, and has an angelic little face. But dig a bit deeper, and it's clear something about Henry is dead wrong. If I let you go, you think you could fly? When Henry's cousin Mark comes to visit, he quickly learns that Mark has an evil side. The problem is he can't convince the adults that Henry is one bad son. Macaulay Culkin and Elijah Wood star in this suspense thriller, The Good Son. Henry is just, oh, they're so used to him being, oh, he's so, so nice. He's, oh, he's our good son and everything. And then, you know, why would they believe just a person that just came, you know, a week ago? Joseph Rubin, who directed Sleeping with the Enemy, says the challenge of this movie was to make the usually sunny Macaulay look dark and mean. For me, so challenging about the movie is that Mac is this sunny, uh, very upbeat, very positive kid. And yet he's playing the dark side of all this. Another challenge was to keep the kids safe while staying true to the stunts. We're trying to do everything real. Do it with the real kids, the real height. Jack Gill is the stunt coordinator, and he's been working with Mac and Elijah, getting them comfortable in safety rigs, getting them comfortable with climbing and dangling. Despite being enemies on screen, off screen, Macaulay and Elijah became fast friends. And even though they're precocious 12 year olds, when it was time to act, all involved say they were grown up professionals. He's got everyone fooled. Everyone thinks he's this great kid. But he's really evil. Lisa Petrillo, Channel 10 Eyewitness News, Daybreak.